Hey guys, thanks for watching. Please remember to subscribe to our channel, Lonely Stick of Dynamite. Today we're talking to Jonathan Bushell, who's an entertainment lawyer, and he's been in the industry for 25 years. Jonathan's had a really prestigious career, and he's worked with Polygram, and just recently he's finished working with Curzon Artificial Eye. Jonathan, more importantly, is one of the producers, one of the three producers on this short film, Lonely Stick of Dynamite. We're doing a series of videos with Jonathan Bushell, covering five key legal aspects of the film industry. If you don't want to miss out on any of these videos, then please subscribe to our channel, Lonely Sticker Dynamite. So here's part one, which deals with chain of title. To understand what chain of title is, you have to first understand copyright. And copyright is just the ownership of the film and who has an ownership right in the film. I think the easiest way to discuss it is to think about the creative process and who is involved in that process in creating a film. Um, so it'll be anybody from the, um, the book you've based the film on or the script writer who wrote, you commissioned to write the scripts, right through to the um, producer and director. And in order to be able to exploit your film, you have to lock down chain of title and copyright. So what, um, in chain of title, what you have to make sure is that um, one, you, kind of one company or one um, um, entity controls all those rights so that it's easy for a third party who, who would want to distribute or acquire rights, um, kind of exploitation rights or distribution rights in your film, can easily see that they are located in one place. So chain of title, you would probably start with, yes, if you base it on a book or an article, on the writer. So you do an option agreement and lock that down and make sure that um, uh, if you have any, op um, any periods of uh, where you're developing the film, that you've paid all the option fees and stuff, and, and that you have a record of that. Um, if you don't, uh, if, you're, if you're commissioning a script writer, well then that's the first stage you're going through. That if it's not based on anything else, it's an original script, then you have to make sure that you are um, placing all those rights that the script writer would have upon creation of the script um, that they're assigned to the company. So what, what's happening is that the copyright in the film that is controlled by that script writer uh, will be assigned under agreement to the entity. And you do this with everybody who's in the creative process. So it would be the director and the producer so that you have um, in one area, um, in one company, all the rights. If there are any other topics you would like us to cover, please let us know in the comments. Thank you very much for watching.